Hi YouTube, what's up? My fans, all of you out there, 64 of you now, we're growing. I'm telling you it's gonna be at least 100 by the end of 2021. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy to have you here. Thank you for showing up. Thank you for watching this. Today's video is aimless. I think that's the word I'm trying to use. I have no direction and I'm filming this on Thursday so that I can have one pumped out for you on Friday because I'm getting better at this. It does take me to some of the content of today's video, which is catching up on stuff that I did not do yesterday. We're not perfect. Today's video, I thought I would just take you around with me through the day. It's 2.34 right now, which means the day is already mostly done, but I'm gonna cut you into a little montage of what I've done earlier in my day. So you feel like you really get the whole thing, you know? And then my plan for afterwards is to head to a coffee shop, do some work, and then we'll see, hopefully I get some inspo. I'm also so incredibly nervous about bringing you to the coffee shop with me that it is causing such a mental hurdle in my, in my brain. It might have to be iPhone footage there, just cause there's not really, any like super private space for me to pull out my camera and vlog and although I am trying my absolute best to get really good at this it's just like impossibly hard sometimes you can have all the confidence in the world still pulling out a camera in, a, in the middle of a coffee shop and talking to it might be like a like a next month challenge for me guys it's hard if you haven't done this it's like so stupidly hard for no reason other than fear of what other people are gonna think of you i guess so maybe i'll bring you to get over that fear because that is something good to do for yourself but anyways i'm gonna stop cut it off stop talking about <laughs> random shit and cut you into the montage scene so remember i'm setting the scene right now so here is what the first few hours and then the last two hours have been like for me Vampire Diaries. That was me going for a run. Did you get the full picture? Did you get it? Some of that. Some of that. And welcome to the kitchen. We're getting into my actual day. I'm gonna do some dishes. Oh, wait, when I come home from the coffee shop, they're done. Except for it's really hard to talk and do dishes at the same time. Also, this thing is like... So loud. So I'm gonna do dishes off camera. I know, I know, you guys were begging for it because it is really, really interesting content. I'm just gonna tell you what I'm doing. I don't know why I'm being weird about it. I am going to write, edit a blog post, post it, and write another blog post. And then eventually we're gonna edit this video so that you can see me tomorrow, spend time with me tomorrow on the old tube. I'm being weird today. What is this about? I saw these books that I need to return to the library because I've had them for about a month and I have not even started to read them. So that's a task for today. I'll take you with me on that. We can go see the little clubhouse library later. Life is so fun and crazy, isn't it? You guys know that stress when your Uber is just getting like closer and closer and you're not ready and you're just like, ah, that's where I'm at right now. And instead of doing stuff about it, I'm sitting here talking to you. Uh, sorry, David, I will be down. I swear, I swear I will be down there very soon, very shortly, David, I'm coming. He's not here yet, but let me give you the fit check. Got my booties. That's the fit. This is so cringy, but I'm doing it. You probably can't hear me. I got to the coffee shop, having some real caffeine, and I checked my email for the first time in a really long time. And my internet's not really working, but I posted these things on Etsy like forever ago, just prints of some of my photography, and I also have candles on there. So I got this email saying that one of my things sold, and I like freaked out because I thought it, I was like certain it was one of the candles that are in storage in Vancouver, which like 
there's no way I'm not back in Vancouver for like two months so there's no way that that's going to be so I was like oh this is like one of my first Etsy sales and I'm gonna have to go and say that I don't have the product but it was actually one of my prints that I can drop ship which is insane so I'm gonna figure that out now and work on my blog stuff I am so excited like I can drop ship this that's crazy anyways that's what I'm working on I'm sitting in a stairwell. I just finished up at the coffee shop. I am waiting for my Uber. That was a really productive couple of hours for me. I did this inside, which was scary. Wrote a blog post that I still have to edit and post tonight, but I will do it and I'm really jazzed up about it. I did that whole like Etsy sale drop ship to that, which was like really unexpected. That's basically it. It feels like I did a lot more, but that's fine. We're like still really jazzed up about that. Now it's like 5.30, so I'm gonna head home. That way I can walk before it gets dark because daylight savings is fucking me up, <laughs> to say the least. All right, I am officially back home. I'm so happy. Um, a bug literally demolished my foot. That's fun. I got two bites on my freaking ankle, which is like the worst spot to get bites. Something I'm gonna have to deal with for the next few days. I did not do my dishes before I left the house because I was so chaotic. So I'm gonna do that after my walk, which I am about to go on because it is dark and spooky out there. I did say I'd return those books today. So we're gonna go return the books. Hopefully I don't get demolished by bugs again. I would be upset. And I came home to an Amazon package. I keep saying I'm gonna stop supporting Amazon. Then here I am, because I want stuff quickly. This is the problem. So we'll do a little unboxing. It's not anything super exciting, because I know what this is. It's not like a fun surprise, where I like, I just went on an ordering spree and didn't realize what I was buying, but. I'm excited. I got a new book. I was listening to a podcast. It was with Ed Milet and Mel Robbins about her new book, which I bought because I thought it was really good. And how she speaks was very, you know, she uses a lot of stories and she doesn't like bullshit it. This was on sale. The hardcover was only like 14 USD and the paperback was like 20 USD or something. So we got it. Next time I am going to go to a small bookstore. I swear. Do you guys want to come along on my walk or, or do you want to stay here? It's pretty dork. I guess there's no harm in bringing you and just not using you if it's too dark. I really don't want more bites on my ankles. Bug bites on your ankles are the worst. Does the library close? I still have to go for a walk anyways because of 75 hard, which by the way, my Monday's video is going to be talking about my experience so far with 75 hard. So if 75 hard is something that you've been considering, something that you've been wondering how I feel about it or something that you have no clue about. So if that's something you're curious about, turn on post notifications, it's that little bell down there, I think. Might be down there. I don't know which direction this ends up going when it's posted. It's gonna be coming out on Tuesday. I'm doing videos Tuesday and Friday now. So if you want more content from me, turn on the little bell, make sure you're subscribed, and make sure to hit that thumbs up button. Or thumbs down if you don't like it. You know, I like honesty. Do that, because I'm that's the video that I'm gonna be making next. Let's fucking go! me and the moon except for you can't see me but you can see the moon spooky season forgot that you need a mask to get into the clubhouse so I'm headed back secured the mask into the abyss we go oh my god it's not even turned around right oh my god I can't see a single thing this looks like a paranormal activity advert. And I feel so awkward, but made it to the clubhouse. My hair is a hot mess because it's humid. And I'm gonna go put these books inside. So apparently the um, clubhouse closes. That's fine, it's fine. Just walk back with these books. I needed to go for a walk anyways, so it's fine. 
back on the to-do. I'm a little bit clammy and my hair is very different than what it was when I started my walk. I made it back. I hate daylight savings time officially. It is the bane of my existence because it is 7 p.m. and it feels like I just went on a walk at like 10 or 11. I'm gonna get into something comfier and cook some dinner. I'm in my comfy clothes. That was the best way to show you, right? I'm gonna show you what I'm making. So we're gonna do Ew, bug. Fuck out of here. Rice, beyond meat with uh, mushrooms and peppers. I wanna kill this bug. I'm gonna add some broccoli to this bad boy. Frozen broccoli, so it's gonna need a minute to defrost. Got my bag secured. That's about it. Just gonna fry it all up in a pan. I have a microwave. Oh my God, there's so many bugs in here today. Why? I didn't even open the thing. I'm confused. I just re reheat it all in a pan. Nothing crazy. It's not rocket science. Just put all that stuff in a pan and call it a day. I made it to the couch. Got my meal. Beyond meat, broccoli, and brown rice. Super exciting. Got my beverageino water. I am going to watch some Vampire Diaries as I eat and then do the rest of the stuff that I have to do as I watch Vampire Diaries, and that is my evening, so nothing super crazy. Thank you for spending the day with me. I am really appreciative to everyone who watches these videos to the end. It's just me doing things in my normal life, and half the time I'm not even in focus. So I really, really, truly appreciate you. If you want to hit that subscribe button, you should probably do it. If you want to hit that thumbs up, you should probably do it. If you want to turn on post notifications for my next, wherever that goes, uh, my next post every Tuesday and Friday. I post new videos. You get two doses a week of me. And then if you check out my IG and other socials, you can have me literally all the time. That is the end, and I wish you the happiest of days whenever you're watching this. And I'll see you on Tuesday. So, bye!